What's up guys? So I was in the area and I decided to stop by the V3 supercharger that's in Fremont at uh, Cato Road. Um, I'm not really at a super, super low charge, 82 miles, good enough. And I did the navigate to thing. So the battery is kind of conditioning before it gets there. So hopefully we can see a, a pretty good charge rate. Um, I don't actually need that much battery because I'm just going to go charge at work tomorrow, but I thought it'd be nice to, um, just, just to check this out. I've been, I've been to this location before back when they had the beta for the v3 charger but that was in a different location um somewhere like over on the other side but this is uh 12 i believe it's 12 let's see yeah 12 stalls and it's uh, open to the entire public and by the way apologies for the quality and sound i'm actually filming my phone this was totally an unexpected detour so I'm going to um have to put up with some not too great quality so here you see the chargers and Right now it's 11 at night. There's a ton of people here because I think this is uh, one of the factory locations uh, It's really hard to see but like beyond here There's probably like I want to say thousands of cars parked here. They're all uh, Tesla employees uh, working in the factory. It's it's a lot of people. But anyways, let's come over here And let's try charging so You can see the cord is a little bit thinner then um, the V2 supercharger cords. And let's plug that in. And it's charging. Okay, so you can see here it's ramping up. And it's going higher. It's going higher than uh, last time I tried. Wow, okay. 191 kilowatts, 818, 819, 820, 25 miles an hour, 830. Wow, this is, this is great. 195, 196, it's kind of wrapping back down. Wow, that is really, really fast. We'll charge up to probably maybe like 100. Let's see how long that takes. Starting to kind of level down a little, but still holding strong. Um, definitely higher than the 150 kilowatts you would get right now at V2 superchargers. Didn't hit the magical 250, but I'm sure your battery would have to be almost near zero for you to get that. No, but just like that, over 100 miles. That was really, really fast. Okay, I'm going to go and stop the charging now. So that's it for the supercharging. As you see, in that in the time it took me to unplug it, it even added a couple more miles. So that's pretty great. Uh, it cost me a dollar and four cents. Yeah, just quick video about the V3 supercharger. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video.